AEW welcomed back live fans, and City touring with a strong Road Rager special of AEW Dynamite. The show was already stacked from top to bottom with some of the most exciting matches. However, there were still more surprises in store for fans as former WWE superstar Aleister Black made his AEW debut. AEW Dynamite. Road Rager kicked off with a strap match between Cody Rhodes and QT Marshall. During the closing moments, Cody went to touch all four corners. However, the lights suddenly went off as he touched two out of the four corners. Although they came back in a few seconds. Everyone in the arena, including Cody looked confused over the light going off. Some even thought that it was some, kind of a botch. However, it wasn't. Later in the night, Arn Anderson came out to the ring for an interview with Tony Schiavone. However, before the enforcer, could say anything, the lights went off once again. The lights came back, and this time, former WWE superstar Aleister Black aka Tommy N stood in the ring corner. Before Anderson could make any move or get answers to why Black was there. He instantly hit him with a black mass and smirked. Cody Rhodes then came into the ring cautiously to check on his coach. However, he too, fell prey to Malachi Black's black mass. The entire Miami crowd, erupted, as they couldn't believe he was here. It was noted on commentary that Aleister Black isn't going by Tommy End, but is going by the name Malachi Black instead. WWE released Black last month on June 2nd as part of their string of releases that also included Braun Strowman. An embarrassing WWE clerical mistake, made Malachi Black's debut, on last night's AEW Road Rager show possible, reports PW Insider's Mike Johnson. That it happened so soon after Black's WWE release on the 2nd of June raised eyebrows, given that the promotion typically slaps cut wrestlers with a 90-day non-compete clause. If active, this would have prevented Black from showing up elsewhere before the 31st of August. But it wasn't active. According to Johnson, WWE failed to update Malachi's non-compete clause from NXT's standard 30 days to 90, when he was promoted to the main roster in 2019. Thus, Black was able to show up in AEW long before many may have expected. Hence, he could make his AEW debut just a month after his WWE release. Aleister Black, or shall we say Malachi Black, was appreciative of his time in WWE, but was certain on making an impact now that he was off the shackles. And looking at the way he debuted, it surely is one of the most impactful debuts we've seen in recent memory. Zelina Vega has posted her reaction to Aleister Black's AEW debut on her official Twitter handle. <laughs> Why did Malachi Black attack Cody Rhodes, though? Yes, we will know in the weeks to come on AEW Dynamite. Oh, let me up with a bright smile on now. Put me in the dark, it won't get lost now. To the moonlight, I see you.